Hi, my name is Chris Centeno. I'm a medical doctor and medical director of Regenerative Sciences. And welcome to our website. Regenerative Sciences is a company that takes mesenchymal stem cells, uh, isolates those, grows those to bigger numbers, and allows physicians to transplant those same patient cells into a specific area of the musculoskeletal system. I got involved with uh, autologous mesenchymal stem cell uh, research and treatment mostly out of frustration as a pain management physician. Uh, I'm boarded in interventional pain management, which is the use of uh, x-ray guided needle-based procedures to relieve pain. One of the things that's frustrating in interventional pain management is we do very little to actually solve the problem. In fact, uh, there's very little solving the problem going on in healthcare these days. It's either cover the problem up, cut the problem out, um, somehow modify the body through surgery. Obviously a better solution would be if we could actually repair musculoskeletal tissue. That means repairing ligaments, repairing uh, bones that won't heal, repairing uh, discs, repairing cartilage, uh, repairing big muscle tears, all of that. The way to repair those things ideally would involve just injecting repair cells into the area. And autologous mesenchymal stem cells are basically repair cells. They're used by your body all the time to repair various injuries. All we do at RSI is to take those cells in the Regenex procedure, we isolate them, we grow them to bigger numbers, and we place them back in. So it's really your body repairing itself, but just with more repair cells on board to get the repair done. So if you have a hard time repairing a certain area, uh, obviously we all have injuries that, that don't repair themselves from time to time. All we do is to amp up that repair or increase the likelihood of repair by putting more repair cells on the ground in that local area. We're heavily involved in research at RSI, meaning that we are constantly uh, looking at MRIs uh, before and MRIs after of various patients involved in our research programs. Just uh, isolating mesenchymal stem cells and growing them to bigger numbers is, is really not enough. You've got to learn how to, how to apply those cells to specific areas. Treatments for discs are very different than treatments for a rotator cuff tear. A treatment for a rotator cuff tear is very different than the treatment for a knee. It's not possible at this point, even though there's a lot out there that would seem to, like it is possible, to just inject cells IV and have them magically go to the right place and repair everything. It really doesn't work that way. Uh, they've got to be delivered to a specific spot. So to get them to that specific spot, we use MRI plant fluoroscopy. What that means is we'll look at a high field MRI image, we'll take that image and define exactly where the spot is in need of repair, and then from there we'll superimpose that image on top of an x-ray image so that we can use the x-ray to drive the needle to the exact spot. At RSI we get cells in specific spots. So rather than just trying to inject cells IV and hoping they go to the right spot, we place those cells in that specific area. We use MRI to localize that area and then x-ray to get to that exact spot. Getting cells at the exact spot is a big advantage of the Regenex procedure. Where will stem cell therapy go? We're at the beginning of a very long road for cell-based medicine. There's a lot of excitement going on, but the big hurdles are actually being solved at RSI right now. At Regenerative Sciences, what we're doing on a daily basis is solving the problems of how you get cells to repair specific areas. How do you get those cells to those areas? What procedures are necessary and, and what's the best way to use those cells to, to, for a specific purpose? Again, repairing a lumbar disc is very different than repairing a knee, which is very different than repairing a shoulder. All of those procedures are being worked out at Regenerative Sciences. And where this is going to go long term is basically to completely change the playing field. 
the playing field will change from rather than waiting to a joint, for instance, gets bad enough where we need to replace it, it's going to change to go the other direction. We'll start repairing these joints when they first start to get injuries and preventing that long-term degeneration that will require a joint replacement down the line. I could certainly see a future where 80% of the elective surgeries that we're doing now to replace joints uh, goes away over the next 10 to 20 years. And I think regenerative sciences will help to reduce those surgical joint replacement rates uh, by repairing things early rather than waiting until they get so bad that they need to be changed or replaced. What's the difference between this procedure and other procedures? Uh, we're the uh, only company right now uh, in the United States doing this type of procedural based stem cell work. There are other companies that are doing nucleated cell isolations. What that means is they take out a very dilute stem cell population and re-inject it the same day. The problem is in order to get most repair jobs done, you need many more cells than you can get that way. So you actually have to go in and grow these cells out to bigger numbers and then re-inject them. Other big differences are that we don't inject cells IV and hope they get to the right spot. We actually place those cells in the right spot based on the MRI image, which is obviously a big advantage. Hoping they get to the right spot is very different from identifying where that right spot is and then getting there with a, with a needle under x-ray guidance. The other big difference is that just mobilizing cells from the bone marrow is not going to do it. Uh, the cells that are mobilized from the bone marrow with drugs or, or supplements are not the kind of cells that repair musculoskeletal tissue. They're the kind of cells that make new blood. So they're blood forming stem cells and not tissue repair cells. In conclusion, uh, Regenerative Sciences is a company dedicated to learning how to use mesenchymal stem cells to treat musculoskeletal disease. That means to repair things rather than to cut them out or medicate them. That means to place cells in specific areas rather than injecting them IV and hoping they get to the right spot. That means actually changing the playing field in the long run so that we actually repair things rather than waiting until it gets so worn out we've got to actually replace the joint.